in the industry, this is com called the complex sales model, so a complex solution model. Can you perhaps dwell around this a little bit more? And, 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 and i like to understand how this part is essential to move you know, uh, to the next part that is basically develop an actual product or if you like, automate a process inside uh, the corporate. Yeah, absolutely. And it's a tremendous tool to really get stakeholders aligned, really getting people in the room who just have no experience spending a lot of time together. So executive sponsors, system architects, head of data, all these people really need to come together in a line in a meaningful way. So what we're trying to do is have them hear each other's perspectives and then ultimately land on a strategy and a goal and a way to measure any AI program, taking into account their perspectives as well as customer perspectives. So that's ultimately the hardest part, but when you can do that, you can really build off something very sustainable. And then step two is to try to understand intimately where is the data relevant to that strategy? How can we measure that goal and how can we collect more data if there are data gaps? What are the technology dependencies? How do we bridge those? And ultimately try to find a path for them that they can find today and then ultimately help them build a better, stronger path for the future by filling in data gaps, whether it be creating within those four walls more of the data they need to pull off an AI use case or helping the broker data from the outside. How do we bring in data from a partner or data that exists by way of social media, for example, to enrich data sets inside the business that would make the use case more interesting. So once we understand the business and the data, we can start to say, here are the use cases that are in bounds for you. These ones would drive the most value. These ones would be the most effort. And what's that sweet spot where we find something very low hanging fruit that's low effort and drives a lot of value. We select that first and then we really start to figure out what type of models we want to use against it. What is the data plan to collect and prepare the data to feed that and train that model. And then ultimately a model is great, but the really hard part about AI is making a model a usable solution that businesses and stakeholders can drive value from. So what is that engineering plan to go from model to execution? And again, if we can do that very, very quickly, we've given people a tremendous starting point.